Hi family, hi friends, happy spring day, we made it, we are alive, we're still kept safe, we are full of gratitude this morning, I'm full of joy because it's another season and yet I have seen it. My family is still protected, nobody has passed away from COVID and I thank God for that this morning and I just got reminded of his love for us, his love for me, that out of everybody else, I know he still kept you, but out of everybody else, he still kept me, he's still protecting me and I woke up with the Psalm, Psalm 100, it's actually a Thanksgiving Psalm to God, it says, shout with joy to the Lord, O earth. Worship the earth with gladness. Come before him, singing with joy. Acknowledge that the Lord is God. He made us and we are his. We are his people, the sheep of his pasture. It says, enter his gates with thanksgiving. Go into his courts with praise. Give thanks to him and bless his name. For the Lord is good. His unfailing love continues forever and his faithfulness continues to each generation imagine the, unfa the unfailing love of god is always you know it's a matchless kind of love i was thinking this morning and i said lord your love never takes anything away from us it actually gives us more and more each and every day what can i do to return my gratitude and the Bible even says it's just by praising him, remembering him that he is God and that he made you. You are the sheep of his pasture. He will never leave you and he will never forsake you. Whatever you are going through this morning, remember the good in your life. I promise you, if you list everything in your life, you will see that the good always outweighs the bad. No matter what we are going through, but the bad always rises and seems as if it is the only thing that is... um that is important at the time. And you actually realize it's just shifting your focus. But God says, come to him at all times with thanksgiving in all situations. Not that we are thankful even for the bad situations, no. But in that situation, you know that he is carrying you. You need to know from the bottom of your heart that you are his, he made you. So what, so what the Bible says. So he can never forget about you. He's still thinking about you. Guys, let us enjoy our lives. Let us be grateful that we are still chosen to be alive. It is by grace. It's not because we chose to be alive, but because God chose us. And he still has a purpose for our lives. La, I love you. And let me go to work now. Time. But enjoy your day. Happy Spring Day, family.